Alright guys, welcome, welcome. We are in the big town of Mournville, Alberta. And we're about to head out on a camping trip with my brother-in-law and sister-in-law, Sherry and Trevor and little hunters coming with us. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. We are two gringos on the Gulf, but today I am in Mournville, Alberta, about to go camping in this house on wheels. Silverado High Country diesel pusher. Alright guys, we're only about an hour away. We just stopped for some food. Just about to our destination. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's it guys. Pretty much. Park. Maybe moving an inch or two, but I think that's good. He's got to save room for the slide outs, right? You got a slide out on this side, it's got to come out, and then a slide out on the other side. There it goes. That's it. Okay, Trevor is the master chef camping. And look at that. Whoa, pork loin corn delicious potatoes trevor always cooks camping and look at that corn yummy yummy alberta corn sweet corn that's it he's gonna yell at me for leaving it open <laughs> Twenty more degrees, he says, and it'll be done. Master Chef. Now we're not far from the river. As you can see, I got uh, Trevor's bike. He borrowed a bike stand so he could bring his bike for me to ride. Oh, here comes some ducks. <laughs> been your way, am I? I need a YouTube channel. Yeah, it's uh, my GoPro. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So, <laughs> I was on the trail there, and a little boy come up on his bike, and I was kind of blocking his path. As you can see, the trail's quite narrow, and right away he says, uh, Are you making a video for your YouTube channel? <laughs> He's probably about 10 years old, maybe 11. And he knew right away what I was doing. <laughs> okay, the trail is not too bad for this tiny bit here, so <laughs> I'll go one-handed. This is all right, nice little trail right along the river. Oh, someone's not happy. <laughs> They're launching the kayak down there. Kid was just screaming. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Look at that tree there. Nice. All right, guys, this is quite nice here. This is a pretty good trail. You got campers all over here. All right, guys, so they got these tents here. It's kind of like a little cabin. And they're $40 a night, and there's a bed and table in there, and there's a fridge in there. They have power. Pretty decent, actually. So it's like a canvas 
tent cabin, right? But look, you can see they're quite big. I'll take a walk over here and show you this one. Doesn't look like anybody's in this one, so we'll go take a peek at it. So, buddy was telling me they're 40 bucks a night. 35, 30 to 40, he wasn't sure. So roughly. Canadian, obviously. I'll put the American price up there for you guys. Be a lot cheaper. There's a few of them down here. As you can see. And then the river's right here. And you do have uh, data down here. I was using my phone back at our campsite, so I would imagine you have data service here as well. I had pretty good service, actually. I was sent Jennifer some pictures and a little video and whatnot. And there you go, here's the river. Right here. Look at that, eh? Nice. So there you go. Winham it's called. Winham Campground. I'll put the spelling up here for you guys and then the link will be in the description again. You can check it out. If you're ever here in southern Alberta. So we're not far from Calgary. Alright guys, so this is the day use area now, pretty sure. So, and you got the dam right here by the day use area. We'll ride the bike down here. Got some uh, people down here using the day use area. I said there was people in the river over here. Hi guys. Gracias. Speaking Spanish, <laughs> just habit. <laughs> Danger, we are ahead, keep out. Uh, they got the fence up there, but you can go right up to here. Oh, there's a couple of uh, big pelicans down there. Nice. Well, let's park the bike and maybe walk up to the edge there and have a look. Drowning machine. Venturing over the weir is risk. Risking certain death. Escape is impossible once caught in the whirling water. Portage as directed. Yeah, you can see the pelicans there. Oh, they got a bunch of rocks. There we go down a little bit. Sweet. Check that out, guys. How cool is that? You can see the pelicans there. Freaking awesome. All right, guys, that's as close as, as I'm going to get. Pretty cool though. All right, so here's the other side. The dam just right over there. So they're diverting the water. They have it going that way, and then they have it going this way. They got a canal down here. This is obviously man-made for sure. Very cool. Well. Thank you so much for joining me today, my friends. I really appreciate it. God bless everybody out there. Peace on earth. And as always, be kind to one another. I'd give you a peace up, but I'm not going no hands on the gravel road, so <laughs> I don't need to crack my skull open and go home with a broken arm or collarbone or because <laughs> I am pedaling. <laughs> Adios, hasta luego. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Nice.
Hi, how are you guys? Good. <laughs> you can't see them very well, but there's two young boys out there playing with a log in the river. My God. I'm like, you guys be careful. Uh, the one boy is the one that asked me about my YouTube channel and he did it get just now again. <laughs> no, you can't see them very well, but they're out there. You can hear them. 